Reflector, reflector down here, then there's another one down here. And previously they had a plastic piece down here. Okay, you're covering the bag assembly. Mm -hmm. No, no, the back, the back, the, the, other, the only thing that was in here is, see these places where the tubing is wrapped around the yeah, pipe let's, deck? Let's, um, let's, actually, uh, actually, let's put contrast. Okay, those are the input and output cat, uh, catheters, or the, uh, what do you call those devices anyway? I'm not sure what you call these things, what do you call these things? Um, those are just connectors, I mean, they're not, they, they're, butterfly, they're probably butterfly pressure connectors. <coughs> okay, so, there's your, this thing's a control unit, this is just a switch. So, okay, standard blood bag. Okay, hold those for a second. Okay, that's the spiral loops in and out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Assuming that what should be is like that. There you go. Yep, going close. look at these connectors because they look very passive and plain. Mm -hmm. Okay, so those are the syringes. Okay. Okay, got it. This is called a Baxter Fenwall Closed System Apheresis Kit. This is for our Closed System Continuous Centrifuge Separator. Apheresis. And, and it has the blood bag that stays with it, right? Right. So you put the blood bag in the centrifuge. That's how you, you know, keep everything isolated. With PL301. Oh, I totally misunderstood what it was. Okay. Set front mirrored surface inside. Lamp assembly housing. Mm -hmm. 